On a street of big dreams, this tiny house is making a huge impression. This little guy will dwarf what you're looking at around you in heart and soul. Custom home builder Gerald Rolette of Westlake Development Group had the vision to create a tiny house for the street of dreams, auction it off, and give all of the proceeds to local veterans. We have Alex and we have Kim here. And this is why we do what we do. Small on space, but large on style. It's the first tiny home in the Northwest Natural Street of Dreams 43 year history. It's called the tiny house with a big heart. And that heart is all about giving back to our veterans. Westlake rallied its industry, more than 50 companies, from builders to suppliers, to donate their time and materials. All nonprofit, and there's nobody uh, taking a paycheck here. It's all about uh, doing giving back. From its oil-rubbed bronze fixtures to the reclaimed woods, Westlake and its partners, including Empty Nest Tiny Homes and Tiny Innovations, pulled the essence of the Street of Dreams into 204 square feet. It's basically a farmhouse style, a uh, tiny house. All the cabinets were done custom with soft closed hinges. They're all walnut. In the be uh, master bedroom, a beautiful detail wall and same in the living room. It's a little bit small, but it's got a little bar area and then it's got the big 43 inch screen TV. Um, the master bedroom itself has uh, a Murphy's bed, so it's a queen size, it sleeps too with the TV. And you can open it up for additional storage. And we have a full closet with a washer dryer LG combo. It's a tiny home with grand style and a much larger purpose. That money will funnel back into the community and to our veterans and we're excited. And there's not, there's not a better feeling than giving back. There really is not. And so I'm excited that we can do that. You can place a bid on the tiny house of your dreams and support Oregon veterans at tinyhousewithabigdream.com.